What's going on you guys? My name's Ty Knotts and welcome to Top 5 Unknowns. 5 Unsolved Mysteries Caught on Tape. Number 5 Emily Filipov is a resident of Canada who's been missing since November of 2012. Around the time of her disappearance, Emma was spotted on CCTV at a nearby YMCA where she could be seen entering and exiting the building multiple times, almost as if she were trying to avoid someone who was lurking outside. Additionally, in the days leading up to her disappearance, she was known to have phoned her mother multiple times asking if she would come spend a few days with her, and never stated why. Nevertheless, her mother agreed to come, only to be abruptly requested to then not come moments later. It was around this same time that her mother also became aware of the fact that Emma had been staying at a women's shelter, on and off since February of that same year. A few days later, Emma was seen in front of the Empress Hotel, where a witness had called into police and stated that Emma appeared to be in extreme distress. Police then arrived and spoke with her for about 45 minutes before determining that she was perfectly fine. They then left and Emma was never seen again. It's believed that she left the hotel around 8pm that evening, but no one has any idea where she may have gone. Take a look at the CCTV footage. Number 4 In August of 1984, James Cadell was piloting an aircraft headed toward Colorado. For reasons not exactly certain, James crash landed his plane in a wooded area of Colorado and was found a short while later by two hikers. At the crash site, police found a VHS tape that had been connected to a dash cam on the plane, which detailed James's final moments leading up to the crash. It's believed that he had likely flown at too high of an altitude and caused his engines to stall. Unable to get them back on in time, he then crash landed. Take a look at the video. Number 3 In February of 2017, Laura Lucas, a Miami resident, came home late from work and ended up falling asleep on her couch. Her home was heavily guarded by CCTV and resided within a gated community, though somehow a woman managed to break in and hide from Laura until she fell asleep, then emerging and robbing her. The entire event was captured on CCTV, with Laura stating that she has no idea how the woman actually got into her house. The woman is known to have stolen multiple valuables as well as Laura's car, though there's no word on whether or not the woman was ever caught. Have a look at the footage.
number two. In March of 2016, a man from Fresno County was found to have been burned alive inside of his home, with police ruling that the man had taken his own life, even though he was documented as having multiple stab wounds that took place prior to the incident. Additionally, John Lang had been very public about his idea that the Fresno PD planned on taking his life, and even commented on a local news outlet's Facebook page warning them. He also had CCTV footage of random cars that had been parked outside his home on multiple occasions, clips of unknown individuals peering over his fence, and people passing or driving by his house very slowly at odd hours. This all came to fruition after John had uncovered a police scam ring that was taking place in his hometown, in which police would illegally drive through parking lots in low-income neighborhoods and scan unknowing citizens' license plates, giving them information about the car's owner's criminal history and alerting them of any unpaid tickets. Cops would then camp out near these cars and arrest the drivers once they began to drive away, which again is highly illegal. There's no actual proof that this took place, it's simply what John Lang claims happened in the days prior to his passing. Sadly, an investigation was never conducted into the situation to prove one way or the other exactly what happened to John, and the true reason behind his passing remains a mystery. Number 1. A woman by the name of Danielle Yancey posted video footage to her Facebook page of a naked man who entered the porch of her home wearing nothing but a Ronald Reagan mask and a sock. The man could be seen climbing onto the woman's porch, ducking behind a fence, then running off into the night, never to be seen again. As it would turn out, the man was allegedly dared by his friends to do this and was later caught and brought in for questioning. Strangely, there don't appear to have been any charges filed against him. A couple got quite a surprise on New Year's Eve after a man wearing nothing but a Ronald Reagan face mask and a sock was captured on surveillance video outside their house. Reality TV star Daniel Yancey took to the internet to post the video of the naked peeping Tom that was creeping around outside her Alabama house. The skinny naked man with a sock placed over his privates can be seen looking into windows and crawling around the porch before running off. The star of Bravo's Jersey Belle said she posted the raw footage to her Facebook page to help identify the culprit. Authorities say police are still looking for the man. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, be sure to click that like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell to keep updated with our videos.